Now, let's solve for this simple time rates problem. The sides of an equilateral triangle are increasing at the rate of 27 inches per second. How fast is the triangle's area increasing when the sides of the triangle are each 18 inches long? And so let's draw our figure. We have an equilateral triangle, so all the sides will be equal. Since all sides are equal, these will all be x. And then let's draw a line dito. Now, since we have an equilateral triangle, all of the included angles are 60 degrees. And so now, we can already formulate the equation of the area. The area of the triangle is 1 half times base times height. Now, our base is x. And so this will be 1 half times x. And then our h is the altitude of this triangle, which is simply the vertical component of x. Now that's x sine 60, this distance. And so the equation of our area will simplify into 1 half x squared sine 60. And so now we can differentiate this function with respect to time. Now differentiating a, that will become dA over dt equals 1 half. The derivative of x squared will be 2x. However, since we are differentiating with respect to time, we will add dx over dt multiplied by sine 60. And so now, we can solve for dA over dt when all of the sides are 18. And so that will be 1 half times 2. The x that we will use is this one, 18. And then, the sides of the equilateral triangle are increasing at the rate of 27 inches per second. And so dx over dt will be 27. And then let's multiply that by sine 60. Again, all the sides of the triangle are essentially increasing. And so after some time t, it will look like this. These are all dx over dt. And so now, let's solve for dA over dt. 420.89 And the unit will be inches squared per second. And so this will be our answer.